What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Crazy news coming out of the Teen Mom OG franchise is that Teen Mom OG dad, Ryan, and I say dad very lightly, Ryan Edwards and his new wife, Mackenzie Standifer, are in fact pregnant with their first child together. I just saw the news this morning when one of you tagged me on Twitter and I <laughs> was floored because I was on Twitter before I had watched um, Monday's episode and I have to say that I'm pretty floored that they did it so quickly even though I'm not surprised. You know when you're like both floored and not surprised at the same time? That was my reaction because I knew this entire time that Mackenzie was playing to secure her spot like in Ryan's like, what do you call it? Payroll for life. Like she had gold digger written across her forehead from pretty much the moment that we met her. Remember the two of them, not even a year ago today, were driving down like the streets on the way to their like ghetto tacky ass sidewalk wedding with Ryan high out of his mind, nodding out and Mackenzie being 100% okay with it. Like she had her get rich or die trying mentality on to the point where she was leaning on over him to drive and steer the wheel while he passed out behind it and had nothing to say, never demanded that he um, pulled over for her own safety, his own safety, the road's own safety, none of them. All she saw was like the cash register that was at the end of the line if she went and married this man. So that's the reason why I'm not shocked that she decided to get pregnant so soon. You know, even though on the show, her current storyline is that she wants to get into nursing school and then have kids later on. Again, like I said, it hasn't even been a full year since this man has come out of rehab for his very serious like heroin addiction. Um, like he doesn't even seem sober to be honest. I keep commenting on it as weeks go by. He doesn't even seem sober, you know, since he's been out, he's drinking excessively. He just seems to still be an overall mess. But again, you guys have to remember that Mackenzie is only 21 years old. Her brain is not even fully developed quite yet. So like this is just crazy, crazy, crazy. And I'm pretty sure that Ryan is like, in his 30s, like 30, if not 30 yet. Like I do know that he was significantly older than Macy, yet look at the way he handles his life. Just absolutely stunning to see what comes out of this. I did end up watching um, yesterday's episode of Team Mom OG, and I will be recapping that today. Um, and it seemed like Ryan's dad was also on board with the idea of pushing them to make a replacement baby because, you know, they're sad about how they don't get to spend as much time with Bentley as they would like ever since all of this stuff came out about Ryan's drug abuse. And it seemed like Larry really wanted like another kid in his own life as a grandfather. Meanwhile, Mimi Jen was saying that she would like them to wait a little while so that Ryan could be steadily sober. And, um, you know, Mackenzie, again, she wanted to, allegedly wanted to go to school for nursing. And I think that she, you know, was probably just saying that to make it seem like she was doing something outside of just sitting around, you know, spending Ryan's quainty coin. But here we are. I, I don't see her ever going back to school now that she has, you know, got her 18 year retirement plan. I can't understand what it is is about being on this show or Team Mom 2 that makes these people in such a huge rush to have kids that they bring their kids into the most precarious and dangerous situations like ever. You know, like who sees an addict, you know, especially a heroin addict and goes, huh, I really want you to father my child. You know, and not only that, I want you around the child that I have, even though you're deemed too unsafe to be around your own damn child. Like it just makes absolutely no sense that this is <laughs> the direction that Mackenzie has chosen to take her life in. But again, gold digging knows no bounds, especially if you watch things like Housewives of Beverly Hills, where these women are marrying men old enough to be their grandfathers, just, you know, to get a place in their wills. So, Ugh, is all I have to say. Absolutely disgusting on your part, Mackenzie, and it just goes to show how little regard you have for your own life and your children's lives to be permanently shackling yourself to this. I'm pretty sure, like 90% sure, Ryan to this day still has refused to pass a drug test for Macy yet he's still good enough for your kin, right? Like no standards whatsoever, so long as there's a check attached to it. That wedding, you know, outside of the sidewalk wedding, which was weird and like awkward and just ridiculous. And uh, what was it? I called her a black widow, black widow of her to go through with. Their actual wedding showed zero signs of chemistry anywhere. Like there could have been a chemistry teacher in there giving a little lecture and I would still say there was no chemistry anywhere to be found at that damn wedding. It's amazing to me that they even like, you know, do the things that lead to babies, right? Like 
absolutely crazy. Ryan also went back and forth about his desire to have kids. One episode, he was like, no, no, no. The next episode, he said yes for Mackenzie, but behind her back to like his dad, I think it was, he said that he wasn't ready. So I wonder what went on here to make this possible. You guys, what do you think about the fact that teen mom OG parasite Mackenzie Standifer is in fact pregnant with Ryan Edwards' second child. Leave all of your thoughts and opinions in the comment section down below. And as usual, we'll chat. You can also like this video, subscribe for more. Feel free to share it with your friends as well. And follow me across social media where I absolutely love chatting with you. That's all for now. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.